You're welcome to Green Nigeria. Nigeria blessed with fertile land, natural and human resource. You're welcome to Green Nigeria. Looking at tourism and agriculture alone is enough to transform our potentials into impactful productivity. Green Nigeria Radio Show. Where we use tourism and agriculture to educate, foster peace, and bring about our national orientation. Tourism, agriculture, progress. Every Thursday is 1 p.m. on your ultimate in style. Ray Power 100.5. Uja. Powered by Flashpoint Energy. You're welcome to Green Nigeria. Okay, good afternoon to you. And of course, you're welcome to Green Nigeria Radio Show. My name is Meshak Yage. Today on the program, like we always do it, don't forget Green Nigeria Radio Show is a show that talks about tourism and agriculture. We believe with tourism and agriculture, we can get Nigeria flying again. Okay, so we pick a particular state in Nigeria. We tell you about the tourism aspect of that state. We tell you about the uh, the agricultural aspect of that state, and we try to see how we can get you to visit for anything within this too. Okay, so tourism, agriculture, progress. We take a quick break. We we'll come back. We we'll tell you what state we'll be going to today, and uh, we we'll tell you the lineup of all that we have sequentially this thursday afternoon every time you check your time and it's a little bit uh, past the hour of 1 p.m you know it's time for green nigeria radio show so stay tuned flashpoint energy clean energy for a better tomorrow inquiries contact 0806 781 Eight nine one one, number sixteen at Dedoin Roads Fever Close, suit eleven at Sokoro Police Plaza, AYA Abuja. Thinking of a clean energy for a better tomorrow? Think Flashpoint Energy. If you they brush teeth with toothpaste, they use soap, they bath. You they use roll-on. And your pocket they day dry. If you those things no they give you small small tattery tattery money. Send pocket no they dry to 0806-519-4053. Again 0806-519-4053 on WhatsApp only. Join us as we could teach you for free. okay like i said you welcome back okay every time i say welcome back i feel like did i leave did you leave okay glad that you out there and you are glued okay so again i say welcome back this is green nigeria radio show and of course you know it's about tourism and agriculture and my name is meshak yage okay so um i said i'll be telling you what's up today we'll be talking about abia state the state in focus for today and um, we'll be telling you about sunflowers and uh, the benefits of sunflowers uh, the seed the oil and all that we'll be giving you this afternoon and of course in our interview segment we have dr ikechi agbuba okay and um he will be telling us about brain re-engineering, the key factors against agriculture, uh, its technology solutions uh, that he has uh, provided in terms of ways in which we can do agriculture in a more easy and effective manner. Okay? You're welcome to Green Nigeria. And uh, talking about sustainable agriculture, uh, Nigeria agriculture and youth involvement, Stay tuned. We'll be bringing you this and more. All right, on Green Nigeria Radio Show. We'll take this quick break and we'll bring you Abia State. Stay You're tuned. To Green Nigeria. Because if you they brush teeth with toothpaste, they use soap, they bath. 
you they use roll long and your pocket they day dry if you those things not they give you small small tattery tattery money send pocket no the dry to 0806 519 4053 again 0806 519 4053 on whatsapp only join us as we could teach you for free Welcome back to reach us on this program and you can call 07058121247 07058121247 Facebook we are Green Nigeria Radio Show on YouTube we are Green Nigeria Radio okay so you can check us out and like and subscribe okay okay like i told you we'll be talking about um abia state today and i also told you that i will be talking to the ceo of flashpoint energy now back to abia state abia state was created on the 27th of august in 1991 during the government of general ibrahim babangida the state is located in the southeastern part of Nigeria. Abia State was created out of Imo State and the two sister states share boundaries. Okay? Talking about Abia State today on Green Nigeria Radio Show. Abia is a state in the southeastern part of Nigeria. The capital is Umahia and the major commercial city is Aba, which was formerly a British colonial government outpost in the region. And it's also one of the most populated areas in Nigeria. Uh, Abia State was created in 1991. I said that earlier. Uh, from part of Imo State, it is one of the constituent states of the Niger Delta region. It's also the fifth most industrialized state in the country and has the fourth highest index of human development in the country with numerous economic activities and fast-growing populations as recorded by the united nations earlier in 2018 also houses the biggest cattle market in nigeria in case you don't know abia state houses the biggest market cattle market in nigeria okay talking about abia state now talking about places to visit in abia state they have Azumini Blue River. Azumini Blue River is a tourist destination for nature lovers located in Abia State, of course, along its boundary with Akwaibom State. The river has become a destination for tourists because of the beautiful scenery it offers. Get to uh, Azumini Blue River, you will see for yourself. You, the, the view of the river is crystal blue, okay? Beautiful scenery. Okay. Talking about agriculture in uh, Abia State, agriculture is the major occupation of the people of Abia State. This is induced by the rich soil which stretches from the northern to the southern parts of the state. Subsistence farming is prevalent and about 70% of the population is engaged in it. Okay? Finally, I can't help but tell you about, apart from the Azumini Blue River, um, I can also tell you about a Makama Wooden Cave. It will shock you to know that uh, a hollow tree that uh, can accommodate up to 20 people can be found in Abia State. That the tree is so big and it has become like a cave. It has a hole inside. The tree has a hole and over 20 people can be accommodated inside this tree. Okay? Don't forget where you heard it first. You heard it on Green Nigeria Radio Show. And of course, you can go sightseeing for yourself. The Amakama Wooden Cave in Abia State. Okay? Now, I told you uh, we'll be bringing the CEO of Flashpoint Energy. Of course, you know agriculture has to do strongly with uh, safe and clean energy. That's why whatever we bring on Green Nigeria Radio Show here on Ray Power FM, it's always something that is authentic. That's why we have the CEO of Flashpoint Energy in the building today. You're welcome to Green Nigeria Radio Show. Good afternoon, sir. All right. Uh, good afternoon. Can we meet you? What's your name? I'm your wallet, Michael Bright, my name, sir. Okay. You are the CEO of Flashpoint Energy. Yes, sir. What are the offers that you have at Flashpoint Energy? Flashpoint Energy Limited is a renewable energy company, which we specialize in 
all solar systems and solar appliances starting from solar generator solar washing machine solar iron solar blender solar hot split okay okay. Oh, okay now what, what, what do you mean by solar generator solar generator is a fuelless generator just like your normal generator the only there is that it's not using fuel and it's not bringing out any smoke neither does it make noise and it's safe very very safe you can put it in your bedroom you can put it in your parlor you can put it anywhere now what are the capacities that are available on ground right now and the cost the capacity we have on ground right now start from 200 watts up to 50 kV. Okay, this 200 watts, what and what can it power? Should I be interested in getting one? The 200 watts can power your TV, two fans, and bulb. Wow. And it has a 10 years lifespan. Wow. Wow. How about the 15 kV? You mentioned 15 kV. There's 15 kV, there's 25 kV, up to 50 kV. Okay, okay. So depending on your load capacity. Okay. All right. Um, What if one does not have the cash to get it immediately? Is there any way uh, I can go about it? Yeah, we have already made provision for that. And we partner with two companies whereby anyone that does not have the financial capital could request it's just like a mortgage but the difference there is that the mortgage is not on on house the mortgage is on solar where they could have the duration of six months to five years okay okay now for to, to reach you let's say for more inquiries i want to buy uh, any of your solar products and all that how can we reach you your phone number we are um, my phone number is 080 c seven eight one eight nine one one okay um call it again so that i can repeat after you o eight o o eight o six seven six seven eight one eight one eight nine eight nine one 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 let's take that again o eight o o eight o six seven six seven eight one eight one eight nine eight nine one 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 okay so you can hit you can hit us up immediately you can call flashpoint energy immediately you i i, I take the number again zero eight zero six seven eight one eight nine one one okay welcome to green nigeria uh you can check flashpoint out well you can check us out on our website flashpoint energy limited you can also shout us up on instagram tiktok flashpoint solar and you can come to any of our branches in national assembly aya kuba lube any of it once you put it on map it will direct you to any of the branches close to you so in a nutshell flashpoint energy is not hidden it's not uh, fake it's not fraudulent it's legit it's legit 100 percent and our fuelless generator are real you can come to any of our branches to see yourself and you are the one that does all these things you couple everything yourself i do everything here in nigeria wow. it's not imported wow i build it myself wow mr uh, michael bright i want to say thank you so much for being on the program this afternoon you're welcome sir it's a pleasure sir in our interview segment we have dr ikechi agbuba yeah thank you um mr mishak yeah regarding um technology and um, what it stands to um, offer. My concept of brain reengineering is to paint a good picture for the youth to see what agriculture stands to offer. It's no longer business as usual. The narrative has changed. And what do I mean by that? The technology solutions has changed the narrative. And it has changed it in such a way that... Um, you know, there is now um, understanding of what agriculture can offer since it, it's becoming a major employer of, you know, of labor. Technology has come in to uh, create more food value chains to add value and that takes us to processing. So it's not just to spend time in the farm. The, instead of using the crude implements, there is now tractorization. There is now, um, you know, drones used in, um, you know, a 
Upline. 